I think it's important that we come, that we gather here, uh, coming from very different schools, very different, very different communities of practitioners, of policy makers, of. Uh, of, uh, of scholars, um, very different perspectives gathered here are extremely useful uh, in order to start seeing the linkages, in order to start seeing the coherence between the different fields uh, and realizing actually uh, what this concept means for, uh, for example, the field of adaptation, for the field of conventional disaster risk reduction, uh, what it means for development um, and begin developing a common understanding which so far doesn't exist uh, and in that sense this meeting it's, it's, it's very important because it's, it's a conversation, it's a process that we're beginning. Um, we uh, are not uh, going to come ever to sort of uh, a final answer on what to do or what it means or how to deal with it because we will continue to learn and it's important to have a, a, a good channel of communication open between this, those different communi communities and not only a good channel but also a, a pool of, a, of a, a common understanding on certain key ideas. making the linkages, begin uh, thinking now at home with more time, uh, whether it is uh, people working in, uh, in the research, in the academic community, policy makers or practitioners, thinking how does one link these uh, different elements that are now on the table um, and, and what does those, those linkages look like so that we can have a better understanding uh, develop common knowledge so that we can uh, have a better, um, uh, we can take advantage of the opportunities to enhance coherence and, and uh, foster synergies between those different communities in light of, of, the, of uh, the, the concept of loss and damage. And finally, so that we can enhance action to, precisely to prevent loss and damage.